The Christmas Year and Incentive Benefits of All Government Employees for the Year 2022 Great news, this year, all government employees are entitled to all the incentives, SRI or service recognition incentive amounting to at least 20,000 pesos, rice allowance equivalent to 25 kilograms. CNA or collective negotiation agreement amounting to at least 25,000 pesos, PEI or productivity enhancement incentive amounting to 5,000 pesos. First is the SRI or Service Recognition Incentive, President Ferdinand Marcos Jr. issued an administrative order for granting a Service Recognition Incentive or SRI at a uniform amount not exceeding 20,000 pesos and a one-time rise allowance to all qualified government employees. What is SRI 2022 and who are qualified? What are the conditions? Is there an exclusion? How much is the rice allowance? Is the SRI taxable? What is SRI 2022 and who are qualified? A one-time service recognition incentive or SRI shall be granted to government employees to honor their hard work and dedication of the administration's mission and vision to create more efficient government operations and public service delivery. are qualified civilian personnel of national government agencies or NGAs, including those in state universities and colleges, GOCC, regular, contractual or casual employees, members of the military and the police, as well as fire and jail personnel under the DILG, military personnel of the AFP and uniform personnel of PNP, Bureau of Fire Protection, Bureau of Jail Management and Corrections, the Philippine Coast Guard National Mapping under the DENR. What are the conditions? The civilian personnel must occupy the permanent, contractual or casual positions. The personnel must be in the government service as of November 30, 2022. The personnel must render services at least four months as of November 30, 2022. Those who have rendered less than four months, they shall be entitled on a prorated share of the SRI. The employees have not received any additional year-end benefits. For those less than 4 months, the following percentage must apply, 40% to 10% of the incentive. What are the exclusions? Consultants and experts engage on a limited period of time, laborers engage through job contracts or Pacquiao basis student workers and apprentices, personnel who engage in a job orders, contract of service or other similar situations. Rice Allowance President Ferdinand Marcos Jr. granted a one-time rice allowance equivalent to 25 kilos to all government personnel for this year. Those who are entitled to receive the rice subsidy include civilian personnel in national government agencies, including those in state universities and colleges, GOCC, government financial institutions, 
government instrumentalities with corporate powers, and government corporate entities occupying regular, contractual or casual positions. CNA or Collective Negotiation Agreement Collective Negotiation Agreement or CNA is a contract negotiated between an accredited employee's organization as the negotiating unit and the employer management on the terms and conditions of employment. This includes all the permanent employees, all contractual employees, and all plantilla casual and contract service employees. How much is the CNA incentive, all permanent, contractual, casual and contract services or job orders employees are entitled of at least 25,000 pesos CNA incentive? How much is the CNA incentive, all permanent? Contractual, casual and contract services or job orders employees are entitled of at least 25,000 pesos CNA incentive. PEI or Productivity Enhancement Incentive the Productivity Enhancement Incentive of 5,000 pesos shall be given to personnel not earlier than December 15th of the current year. This will be given to all the government employees to increase productivity or reward employees for their contributions. What are the coverage? The employees are still in the service as of November 30, 2022. The employees have rendered at least 4 months of service as of November 30, 2022. That's it. Congrats to all in the government services. Have a blessed Christmas to all of us. Christmas is the spirit of giving without a thought of getting. It is happiness because we see joy in people. It is forgetting self and finding time for others. It is discarding the meaningless and stressing the true values. Be happy and thankful to God Almighty.